All right. This mod is called Evelyn's Sweetheart. It's a shotgun mod by Pummel Strike. About 48k downloads, 82 megabytes. Do you have a varmint problem out on your Rivington farm? Looking for protection on your trip through the Shadow Cursed lands? Criminals tossing your friends off cliffs and coming for you next? Look no further than Evelyn's sweetheart. Pest control has never been easier. From the rats eating your grain to the adventurers throwing shoes from the rooftops, this shotgun handles long and close range work with ease, making it perfect for personal protection. Purchase this sleek, stylish tool from Quartermaster Tolly. Lower City sun Sorceries Sundries or Skittle the Rat in the Heapside Prison. We're honestly not sure how he got it. And blow all your problems away. Um, there's been some changes made by the uh, creator Pommel Strike. Um, the, and the icons are by Wildspark. This is featured on Larian from Hell, um, the YouTube channel. The console version apparently is bugged at the moment, but um, version 4.1.6.20 has been sent for console review and approval. This was first uploaded October 18th, I believe. Yeah, October 18th this year. And it was last updated November 10th. So let's go ahead and uh, check it out. Yeah, shotgun has a heavy crossbow. You're going to want um, martial weapon proficiency uh, in order to have proficiency with the weapon. So not all um, clerics get it, but Tempest clerics, uh, war clerics get it. Um, fighters right here get it. Um, also, barbarians get it. So, uh, keep that in mind. I also believe, yeah, rangers get it. So, um, ranger actually makes sense for this. Alright, so now Shadowheart has proficiency with it. Um, and you can also see the weapon is um, also a finesse weapon, too. So that's another good reason we're going with um, Ranger. You'll be able to get Rifled Slug, where you quickly reload a shotgun slug. Your next attack deals 1d10 force damage. Um, and then the other ability, or the other proficiency, is this one concussive shot applies days for one turn damage five to eight and you can use that once per battle so being completely transparent here i leveled up uh i finally did this with gloom stalker because it made the most sense um but like i'm just fast forwarding it through this It took me a few hours to actually get this. Oh, yeah, eventually I had to put um, Jihira on my team. Because I tried doing this solo with a shotgun. It was just, it was just, I guess it would just be easier to show you. All right, so this is Quartermaster Tally. This is the first person that you're going to be able to buy the shotgun from. I already got one. Um, but, you know, you never go uh, too much. Um, what? <laughs> Hold on, let me grab all this. Grab that. Because we're about to fight Marcus. Um, I'm about to try to condense this. I spent... Oh man, you guys don't even want to know how, uh, how long.
if you could notice, it's hard for me to stay on topic, but um, pretty much it's, there's going to be like some spoilers, some story spoilers where I show off the shotgun, um, but I'm using mods, so it's whatever. Alright, I'm going to just do a little voiceover, put it on times 8 speed. I wasn't sure if I wanted to get rid of this part, but this is where I use the debug mode. And using the debug mode, you can jump around to like Act 2, Act 3. That's how I'm testing this mod in Act 2. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to get Gale and then Karlak and I got Jahira. So, so she can heal as a druid since I made Shadowheart a Gloomstalker. And for some reason, Jahira um, was level 8. Yeah, I leveled up Gale for, to be our evocation wizard, so he can do like a lot of AoE damage, and then um, Karlak stayed a uh, Barbarian. Jahira, we go. Yeah, I got, picked all the healing spells. I wish you could just heal. Because I, like I said, I tried this a whole bunch of times and I kept losing solo. So I was like, I need a, I need a full team for this. I believe it's on tactician mode. So I don't know why I had the difficulty so I when I'm just trying to show the shotgun off. But hey, it is what it is. Um, I actually like Jira. She's probably one of my favorite companions. Um, yeah, so we got everybody equipped and then we go upstairs. We have Jira on our team now, so we can um, try to set people up because saving Isabel is hard for some reason. Slow it down to about times two speed now and start battle. He's going to show his true colors, blah, 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 blah. Like I said, this is all spoilers, so hopefully you've seen this part already before um, for some reason Karlak jumps into combat down there but I thought Jahira was still up on the roof I don't know I have so, but I have Karlak over there to protect Isabel Red Ambusher. Mm -hmm. I got Eagle Heart. Gives enemies disadvantage on attacking you. But she. He just flew over there and killed her. <laughs> You're probably thinking I was gonna save Isabel, but nope, I didn't. And I almost lost this fight right here. I ended up having to use the cheater's ring, or the cheater scroll uh, mod. That's in the mod manager too, though. Came in handy. Yeah, for Gale, um, I made like a, a huge stack of uh, consumables. And we put Ice Storm over there. Uh, 
Um, healing spirit, it's like a little bird that just heals and it takes uh, Jahara's concentration. Uh, go back into rage mode and then heal. Uh, I healed someone. Uh, still using shotgun. Shotgun's shotgun's actually doing a lot of damage. Um, one of the things I probably didn't even explain when I was leveling them all up was uh, that since it counts as a crossbow. I get a crossbow expert, so you can um, shoot point blank. I don't know if you need it, but it does extra damage if you shoot point blank. So if you take away the penalty, then I don't know. I'm going to try and... I don't know. I thought I use this was so hard. There's so many there's so many of them. And this is like the bad ending. Cause they take Isabel away and it makes like, all the Harpers turn into evil. And then you gotta kill all of them. Um, if I did have any critiques about the mod, the only thing I would say is um, it should have another spawn point in the tutorial chest. Other, uh, because um, if you start up a new save, then you, you can't um, get it until Act 2. Or, oh, well, there's that rat. I, I didn't even see where that rat is. But yeah, there was a rat that um, you can get it from. So you don't have to be an act to... But I, I don't think... Like, I, I still think that rat is in Act 1. So I just think it would, if there was an extra spawn point in the tutorial chest... That way you can get it from level 1 and then you could just level up with it if you wanted to just be like a shotgun ranger or something. Um, let me see if I can speed it up a little bit more. There we go, put on time save. Um, I didn't want the video be too long, but I also didn't know what I wanted to cut out. So, yeah, Gale's over here able to knock them back with a thunder wave. This is when people start going down. We got two down. Use like a little magic missile thing. We go down to three down. So I gotta use the cheater's ring, and then I find out that the cheater's ring um, picked them all up. I can pick up people that are down, so I picked up all three of them since they were all closer together. And it's like, it's like we, we got a little bit of main character plot armor. Because this. I, I don't know why this fight was so hard. The roots started coming in and then the giant roots came in and there was just so many harpers. Uh, anyways, there's just that root. Oh, and it took me forever to remember that Jahira can use Blight and Blight does like a lot of damage to those because they're plants anyways here's 
the end of that and cutscene. It is abominable that you still live. You who has cost us so much. And the murderer of light. These dead need not be buried. Beneath this canopy of darkness, all is one yard of restless graves. You will lie and rot among them. I should end you. But my str Whether the worm in your skull overwhelms you or not, your end will be a vile one. No, we can't really rate uh, mods out of like five stars, but I would give it five stars. Well, we could do the thumbs up though and like it. Hopefully, um, this mod gets more attention. Um, the YouTube creator, she's she's really um re she's really good at this game uh and the mod is just kind of funny like you got <laughs> shotguns but the, yeah the only critiques I, I would say is like maybe in tutorial chess um and then um i don't i don't know if it automatically has crossbow expert but just adding crossbow expert to it would be nice since it's technically considered a crossbow anyways if this video uh, helped you out you're gonna go check out the mod uh, make sure you subscribe check out um Evelyn Morgana like the video share comment if you're gonna use the shotgun it is kind of fun feels a little out of place at first but Eventually you get used to it.